Hi everyone, we're going to talk about hands and fingers today. So we already know that a hand has five fingers, right? One, two, three, four, five. So we're making a chart to see how many fingers go with how many hands. If we have one hand, we have five fingers. If you hold up two hands, how many fingers do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten fingers. And we talked about instead of drawing hands or counting fingers, there's a faster way to figure out how many fingers go with how many hands. So let's try that strategy out for three hands. Something we can do is skip count by five. If I have three hands, one, two, three, I'm going to skip count by five three times. Ready? Five, 10, 15. If I have three hands, there are 15 fingers. What about four hands? One, two, three, four hands would be five, 10, 15, 20 fingers. Five hands, one, two, three, four, five hands would be five, 10, 15, 20, 25 fingers. What about six? What do you think? We can follow this pattern or we can draw another picture. Make a prediction, six hands. One, two, three, four, five, six hands. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 fingers. Let's look at this chart here. What do you notice? Our hands are going down from one to six and our fingers we're skip counting by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Now we already made a chart with people and hands. One person has two hands. Let's look at this chart. And this time we'll say how many fingers go with these hands. So this chart's a little bit different because we're starting with two hands and we're skip counting like this. So let's figure it out. Two hands has how many fingers? Well, if I hold up two hands, I know that I have 10 fingers on those two hands. So I'll write the number 10 here. What about four? Four hands. I'm going to get some pennies to help me out because I like to have something to count on. When we're skip counting, it helps me to count on my fingers or to count on tools like this. So four hands, five fingers on each. Five, 10, 15, 20. Four hands, 20 fingers. Let's move on. Six hands. How many fingers? Let's count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Hmm, are you starting to notice a pattern yet? Let's keep an eye on that. All right, let me move my pennies down here. Eight hands. All right, we have five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Eight hands have 40 fingers. Should we keep going? All right, 10 hands. I like to organize my math tools in 10 frames because then I can just subitize. I just know that that's 10 pennies. 10 hands. How many fingers? Let's count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20. 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. 10 hands has 50 fingers. All right, let's scooch these up here. 
and I need to put 12 pennies. 12 pennies has how many fingers? Sorry, 12 hands. 12 hands, how many fingers? Count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. And our last one, 14 hands. 14 hands, let me add two more hands here. All right, let's see if we can count by five super fast here, ready? Set, go, five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. Wow, 70 fingers on 14 hands. So let's take a look at this. See if you notice any patterns. My hands are skip counting by two. My fingers are skip counting by what? Hmm. My fingers are skip counting by tens. Look at the pattern. Notice what you see. See if you can count how many fingers there would be on 16 hands. I want you to try that on your own. Have a great day.